Hindustan Aeronautics Limited has successfully completed the first flight of its Made in India light combat aircraft, the Tejas Mark 1A fighter jet in Bengaluru. Now, according to the officials, the aircraft was in fact airborne for 15 minutes during the first flight. And according to reports, the fighter aircraft is likely to be deployed at the NAL Air Base in Rajasthan's Bikaner near the Pakistani border. And the first squadron of the aircraft is also planned to be deployed at the NAL Air Base from where it can in fact take care of any Western adversary. So let's in fact take a look at some of the LCA MK1A's interesting features. The LCA is a tailless compound Delta aircraft which is equipped with quadruplex digital fly-by-wire. The aircraft is built with advanced composite materials with reduced weight, increased life and also reduced radar signature. Now, the LCA Mark 1A is a supersonic fighter at all altitudes for air combat and it can carry a payload of as much as 3,500 kilograms. It is best suited for offensive air support. Now, the aircraft has a service ceiling of about 15 kilometers. The LCA Mark 1 will have inbuilt capability to fire the beyond visual range missile such as the Darby missile that is already integrated on the current Tejas itself. Indigenously developed, the BVR missile, that is the Beyond Visual Range missile, called the Astra MK-1, has been identified to be integrated on the MK-1A, which will be a weapon of choice of the IAF. And this weapon will give an edge to the LCA Tejas over its contemporaries like the Sinopark product, the JF-17, in Beyond Visual Range Warfare. With the introduction of the ported self-protected jammers and also the ESA radar in LCA MK-1A, the survivability of the aircraft is further enhanced. Now, the highlights of the SR radar and also the electronic warfare suit is a pretty important aspect of this fighter jet. The introduction of the SR radar in the LCA Mark 1A will significantly improve the range or the regular systems. It will also enable the near simultaneous missile firing for multiple targets and increased situational awareness. The SR radar will be electronically scanned agile beam radar based on transit or it can even receive modules and will support multi-module operations in X-band with a bandwidth of about 600 megahertz. The radar is capable of tracking at least about 16 targets at any given point of time in air-to-air, air-to-ground and air-to-sea modes. Additionally, the HAL officials have added that the LCA Mark 1A jets will come with digital moving maps and also 2D and 3D maps as well. Besides which, provision for global navigation satellite systems, the Indian Regional Navigation Satellite Systems Based Positioning System, the GPS-aided geo-augmented navigation and satellite-based augmentation systems will also be introduced. The LCA Mark 1A jet will enhance the operational capabilities and will take India towards the indigenously developed such fighter jets. For all the latest news, download the Vion app and subscribe to our YouTube channel.